Support for today's show comes from Ed Eureka. Now, if you're a technology professional wanting to get a certification, Ed Eureka has a number of different certs that you can take that will cost you a lot less and still give you the kind of training that you really want. So use the link in the show notes to check out the site. I think you'll find it surprisingly inexpensive. And now we'll be back in just one moment. Episode 2110 of the number one podcast in Apple Podcast, The Job Search. This is No BS Job Search Advice Radio. I'm Jeff Alton, the big game hunter, and welcome. Tell me about yourself. Question that people are still asked incredibly all these years later. And the problem is, if you're a beginner, if you're someone who shall we say, just graduated or you know, has done internships that don't really relate to the work you want to be doing or, you know, like you're the guy who worked for the pool company while in college and now you have your undergrad in a profession. The classic question of tell me about yourself, your answer feels pretty pathetic, doesn't it? This is how to answer the question. Hope you find it helpful. Hope you give it a great review wherever you listen to the show. And for you parents, and you've got kids who are going to be graduating shortly, right? This is a, a podcast episode to share with your student. Get them practicing this so that they don't sound like a dope when they get to the interview. And we'll be back in just one moment. Support for today's show comes from Career Fitter. Career Fitter is a site where they give you a 60 question test takes about 10 minutes. And out of that, they're going to give you recommendations basically for your ideal business environment, a team building approach, career matches, work strengths, income potential based upon job matching, preferred communications uh, methods, weaknesses that you may have, a whole host of things. They'll give you a free report. They have a premium report as well. Quality service recommended by Forbes, Psychology Today, and quite a few others. So use the link in the show notes. It will help you start to figure out some of the things you might consider with a new career. And if you hire me to coach you, I'll give you a little bit of a discount and reimburse you for some of the cost of the premium uh, report. Because it'll help us both with coaching. And now, let's get going. Someone asked the question, I can't believe I've ever, you know, I can't believe I haven't answered this before, but I haven't. How do you answer, tell me about yourself when you have no experience at all? Now, I'm going to work with the assumption you're a recent graduate, of course, and you're trying to find a job. So you have a degree, right? So here's the way I would approach it. You know, I grew up in fill in the blank. I'm going to use myself as an example. I grew up in New York. Uh, family was working class. And um, I have, uh, I went to high school at Taft High School in New York, have an undergrad from CCNY in political science. Now, I have a lot more than what I'm going to talk about, but I'm just going to end it at this point. You know, I have an undergrad in political science. And I'm looking for a position where I can leverage that experience, that training I have in political science, because really, I love doing this kind of work. I love the idea of helping a campaign, helping an organization be more effective. I know I've got a lot to learn because I've just learned what the basics in school. And there's a lot more I'm going to need to know in order to be good. But I'd like to hustle for you. That's one approach. I'm going to use a different kind of background. Again, it's describing the background uh, that you had growing up. Notice, this is like a 50-second answer, right? You know, I grew up in New York, uh, working class parents. um, And while I was growing up, I noticed fill in the blank, something about what your life was like at that point, which prompted me to go for my undergrad in engineering because I was fascinated by fill in the blank. Now, I've gotten a good basic training at school. You know, my undergrad is at fill in the blank. And I want to learn 
and work hard so I can, you know, help an organization in a variety of ways. Because I love this kind of work and I really would like to get involved. Again, notice a concise answer talking about where you grew up, how you became fascinated in your field, and that, and then, then you segue into joining an organization knowing you've got a lot to learn um, and um, you want to hustle for someone. So that's today's show. I hope you found it helpful. And if you did, I've got a lot that's in the show notes that will help you. Go there, take a look at some of the things I highlight. I know it can help you with your search. But I want you to do one thing for me. And that is put in your phone, thebiggamehunter.us, Jeff Alpin, my name. And when you need help, when you need advice, when you have a question, come over to the website, go exploring in the blog, contact me for coaching or because you have a question, I'd love to help you. In the meantime, I hope you have a terrific day and most importantly, be great! Today's show is brought to you by App Jobs. App Jobs is a site that has freelance work, but it's not the typical web design, uh, web creation type of work or digital work. It's things like doing delivery, teaching, being a handy person, driving, cleaning, you know, blue collar kind of work that I know some of you do. Again, I'm going to have a link in the show notes to appjobs.com, and I hope you find it helpful. And now, let's get going.